Welcome back to the vlog, guys. Today we are in my bedroom. This is a sacred place. No one comes in here but me and my sister, my mom occasionally. But I am working on an event that I'm planning in seven days. I've been working on this for a couple of weeks now. I'm like excited, but also like scared and nervous. But I was also scared and nervous for when I did my pop-up event and that turned out really good. So I'm just trying to just have patience and grace and just give everything to God and not stress too much. But ever since the pop-up, I knew I wanted to like do events or even just bring creators together. I say this like all the time, it's like annoying, but just have this like drive to bring us together. So the opportunity came, um, someone I know from Toronto fashion week years ago connected with me and wanted me to plan an event and it was like perfect timing because i also wanted to do an event so we're working together in a partnership for this event and i'm like right now sending out the invites and i'm like scared like every time i send out an invite i'm like because ah! it's like pressure especially when it's like your name on the invite but it should be good by this time you're probably will see the event I'm hoping everything goes well, but I'm giving everything to God, so. So just to give you guys a rundown, the event space is gonna be downtown Toronto. So the event space is covered and it was up to me to find sponsorships and brands to participate. So I've been working on that finalizing a lot of fun brands for this event so i'm really excited i really want to bring a bunch of like different creators so yes you have like your higher creators with bigger numbers but also i want to bring those mid-tier and up-and-coming influencers because sometimes you don't get that opportunity to go to these events so i remember at the pop-up a lot of people were like super happy to be invited even though they were a smaller creator they got to experience like that life so so i'm gonna give you a rundown of everything that i'm doing first thing Thing was to well we have the space I have a decor person I'm working with so we're gonna like set that up I'm gonna be staying downtown near the event space for a couple of days before the event to set up because the pop-up I literally did everything the night before and I was done the event space holds up to a hundred ish people so I wasn't able to make the event public so right now I'm working on like a guest list of different people and I'm trying to get like everyone from each section of like the creative scene in Toronto. I'm gonna read you my blurb so you can get an idea of what the event is gonna be about. We are excited to invite you to our exclusive Black Excellence event hosted by influencer Monique Smith. <laughs> Basically, it's gonna be like a little networking event. I say little, but everything I do is extreme. I'm gonna have a lot of gifting stations. Food is what I'm trying to finalize. I'm really hoping I can find a caterer within like seven days. If not, I'm gonna have to do another thing and do the food on my own or with like some people that are helping me. When you have an event, you need at least like three or six more months to plan it. And I only had one month to plan it. Even the pop-up was less than three weeks. So I pulled it off. I'm really good at like last minute stuff, but obviously if you had the time, it would be so much better and less stress, right? The next event I do, I'm, I'm not doing this again. I'm gonna give myself three months. Let me give you the all the, the dates and tea. So right now, Tuesday, February 21st, I'm sending out my invites. The event is in seven days. Yeah, so I'll be taking you through this week and I'm excited. I'm actually gonna be documenting way more than I did last time. So now you can see the pros and cons and everything. Also, thank you guys so much for supporting me on this journey. I'm like so excited that I can finally do stuff like this and actually include you guys. And obviously I'm doing this in Toronto, but the goal is to do it worldwide so I can reach everybody and just, we can all be connected. We're gonna start the vlog tomorrow and I'll take you around my week, me preparing for everything. And yeah. Okay, good night, bye. So I need the slideshow done today. Mm -hmm. Um. Over poster. Yes, the poster. She didn't give me the dimensions, but if you can just still make something and then um, we can see if we can get it uh, printed or whatever. Mm -hmm. um, and I want something in the goodie bags so of like that list of brands. So I'll keep my laptop here. So if you need to like go on it, maybe I can put the logos in a separate. I have 50 hair sets that I can either separate. There's three products in it or I could just give them full boxes. No, just give them the full boxes. Until so yeah, so some will have hair sets, most of everybody will have the same thing. Oh unless we do fifty with the Goldwell Deluzies and then fifty with the JBL watches. Right? 
Yeah, that's good. Ooh, that's fun. Send confirmation by Sunday night. Visit event space. Website. I mean, I can post website after the event because we'll have the like, content for that. So. Welcome back to the vlog. Right now, I'm at my event space and taking a look at it right now. I'm trying to coordinate everything of how we're gonna plan it out. So I will give you a quick little tour. So this is the creative school. It's a little rundown. Um, the TV screens are supposed to have um, some logos. There's gonna be a panel where I'm talking here. Um, trying to figure out what I'm gonna do with some of these tables. Yeah, so this is a space. We got a kitchen going on over here. All these chairs will be moved once we figure out how we're gonna do everything. So yeah, right now I'm gonna like FaceTime one of the sponsors and see what we're gonna do. Are you busy? And it's like a self-serve. I think there's like wine. He said that's gonna be like right here. I have the cups, I have the bottles. Okay. Um, really, it's, it's really why I need to know what like where it'll be set up and how it'll be. Yeah, that's it. We got a dry here. Oh. It is actually kind of cute. It is cute. See, we got a little view here. Me leaving all my luggage outside. Oh. We got a little balcony. Wow. We have just checked in our Airbnb. Um, yes, we have made it. And <laughs> it was such a struggle. Hey, now we're almost here. Okay, my body is slowly coming back.
we have arrived at the space and we're gonna take a look and see what's happening. Ah! Whoa. Oh! Whoa. Oh my god! No, this is exactly This is exactly. everything! <gasps> okay, so let me look okay. at my list. I'm like Did you finish the list? Uh almost. So I have to like review the questions he's gonna ask me tomorrow. Okay. The emails to the photographers. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We'll handwrite the notes tonight, or I'll, I'll do it. Yeah, I'll write that. Slow. No, it's just beautiful. I'm just looking at it oh, like the flower. So the, yeah, the girl had the flower, oh, the exact yes. flowers. No, I from know. The thing. Yo, like I'm. It looks like the freaking. So my concern was, I want to make sure it looks like the um. The exact. Yeah, like yeah. not the exact, but I just wanted to flow the like vibe. the yeah, like the feathers and everything. No, this is amazing. This is exceeded. <laughs> oh my god. Okay. Okay, that's good. Is that all we're putting in there? Yep. Yeah, I can't think of anything else. Yes, this room. Um, we're gonna Main try room? doing the yeah. shoes. Okay. The shoes. The other half of the dynamite bags. Yeah, we can even just bring it up and then we can figure it out after. At least okay. it's up here and then. Um, Really, just the food and the drinks left. Yeah, like I'm like that's, that's it. it. And then once everything that everything's in here, it's perfect. <laughs> This is part two of me planning the first ever black influencer event in Toronto. So once we had the venue in, vendors confirmed, I made a giant Excel spreadsheet so I could keep track of all the brands that we were having and also when all the products were delivered. We were a week away from the event, so I had to send out all the invites and make sure everyone RSVPs. So I made it in Eventbrite so I could keep track of who was coming. Once we finally got all the admin stuff out of the way, it was finally the fun part. So this is the time we were making all the gift bags for everybody. And we were receiving all of her packages, so we were sorting out the shoes. It was gonna be a long night, so I ordered some food for everybody, and my mom came through to help out. What you need help with? After sorting out all the shoes and finishing the gift bags, we officially have one more day to the event, so I had to do some errands and pick up some cans from our sponsors and bring them down to the venue. Then it was time for the decorations to arrive and then we had to finish off some final admin stuff, just confirming some sponsors and some guests. So across the venue space, there was an empty room. So we decided to make that the gifting suite for the guests. So we filled it with a hundred pairs of shoes and a bunch of clothes. In the fashion industry. Yes, yeah. And author relates to coming up with concepts, writing about them. Oh, yes. You can say, start off with COVID. You mm -hmm. lost your job. <laughs> New skills would have to be like leadership. Or, yeah. yeah leadership, taking control. So, ChatGPT, <laughs> I should be writing this. Actually, yeah. In a way, and then make it in my own. So, let's see. Exactly. If you can find some of their Instagrams, yeah. um, yes. Yeah. And um, I have like most of them. Yeah. And um, I'll also add that to, I guess, what are you info yeah. at? Mm. Yes, yes. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I was like, that's Monique. Yeah. I was like, oh, this is, oh, okay. this is the A lister tonight. Oh, Come thank you. Okay. So no, literally, yeah. they're like, um, with all the luggage. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, obviously, you're here for me. Oh yeah, no, but I just like I didn't look you up. Oh, okay, cool. Hi, nice to meet you. So I'm staff. I'm part of the fashion zone. Cool. Awesome. I am part of the zone. Oh, amazing. Thank you. They're busy, or you can't find them. You'll be there. Perfect. Amazing. Okay. Awesome. And then pay down. Then you pay down your your line of credit, right? Bro, from time, no, from time, from your, from Instagram, I think you guys dealing with Oh, I know, she put a wig on her. We'll show the new sticks on the side. Yeah, it's Open it up a little bit. I was just for a camera. Yes. There we go. Hey. Okay.
Is this it? No. It's, um, strawberries. Oh, I think I know. Okay, bye. <laughs> no, like, <laughs> no one hit, no one said anything about hating. You've been saying that for an hour, like, oh. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> like, what? I meant for me. Oh, uh, 704? Okay. This setting. For the culture, presented by Niche Six. I'd like you to welcome Nate Smith. So amazing just to see all of you guys, and we all look the same. We're all creators, and it's just a, like surreal. I feel like I start to see more people like post different things, and I also wanted to help inspire people. So instead of just posting fashion, I really wanted to focus on helping others, teaching others being able to build a community, which I see right here, which is crazy. And yeah, I feel like it's bigger than social media and there's an opportunity for everyone. So people should be putting like the bloopers, the behind the scenes if you mess up because it shows that you are a real person. And I feel like that goes so much further than just posting regular content. The skills of like a business mindset, you want to make sure you're consistent, you want to make sure that you're motivated. I think when I was starting this, I didn't realize like, yes, you're posting consistently, but are, do you have motivation? Do you have discipline? Are you actually focused on the end goal? I do want to take an opportunity to allow anyone in the audience who may have a question for Monique at this time. All right, okay. So I'm going to be a bit of a Ricky Lane here. Um, how do you keep those contents, but also make it make them different all the time? Like, for example, on Monday, yeah. a, a King content, on yeah. Tuesday, BTS, yeah. bloopers. Yeah. So how do you keep it fresh? You can be on different platforms, but focus on one and use that content and put it on every single platform. Listen to your audience, especially if you're on TikTok and you're getting like questions like, oh, like I love your hair in this, like where'd you get it? Like make that into content. So use what your audience asks you and don't think you have to come up with new ideas like every single day because honestly no one can do that and I can't even do that. So like use what you have already. I'm also an influencer. So I have a very controversial question actually. <laughs> have you known fellow influencers and let's say they ask you a question how much do you share with them? Haters who don't want to help. <laughs> Haters! <laughs> okay. so, Am I wrong? Is that the wrong okay. thing? <laughs> I think, especially with my content, that's why I give so much. Because there's no competition. It's all about community. And that's the reason why we have this event here. To mingle, to talk to one another. Because we are that community. And we need to be open and honest with each other. If I'm giving you information, it doesn't matter if you take it. It's all growing together. And that's the goal of having that type of community. Yeah. 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 Yo, yo, that's a, that's a. Yeah. Creator in social media, like, use this as a vehicle into what you want to do. The world on social media is endless. Like, you can reach out to celebrities, you can reach out to brands. Here in this room has the power to change or actually do something for the industry. So it's like, use your audience in a way that can change the world. But now I'm transitioning more into. I guess hosting events and doing things that brings community because that is the end goal I think for all of us in this room and I hope we all network after this is to bring us together and have a community in Toronto where we're able to speak to other people not be afraid not feel like we have competition like the goal is for us to build that community so putting God in what you do even and just trusting his journey for you see things are not growing fast enough don't worry because you already have your own path 
God already laid it out for you, so you just have to learn and continue. There's a lot of brands here. We actually have some drinks, some food over here. We also have a suite. So there's a couple of brands that have sponsored products. Some gift bags that we'll be giving out at the end, but we're just going to have some music, move the chairs, and just be able to network with each other. So use this time to build those connections and don't go home and be like, I wish I talked to her. Like, just go up to people and just make those connections. For all right, and on that note, let the music play and thank you all. Stay a while and enjoy some time Oh, I love you guys so much. Oh. 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 Oh.
something, say something, say something. Um, I'm having a great time and um, copyright. <laughs> Okay, so tomorrow, yeah, um, one time, yeah, it's time you coming down. He said you're probably gonna sleep in and show for a little bit. I have work tomorrow, so probably after five. In the evening, okay. In the evening, I'll come down. So I love you. Thank you so much. Oh, dude, it's too much. Back history month. Everyone knows this is a special It's gonna be delight. Yeah. Any last words? Yeah. Thanks so much for coming. Bye. She also said. She also said. You want to say to people? Um, thanks so much for being a part of the event. Louder. I can't, there's too many people around. What do you mean? What did you think of the event? Oh, the event was amazing. Wow, so many people. <laughs> Why are you looking at me? Speak to the camera. Oh my god, no, he got me off guard. I wasn't ready. <laughs> so many wonderful people. And so many people were really commenting on Monique's um, love for the community. Um, it was overwhelming and uh, it can only get better. So we thank everyone for coming. It was lovely. I'll tell you what I think. We're going to tell you that this angel right here, she's a star and she deserves to shine. And I'll do everything in my power to ensure that she gets there. So proud and inspired at the same time to see how far she's come. She's doing it. Actions speak louder than words. Okay? Because every day is a gift, that's why it's called a present. Uh, there we go. The original content created. So proud of perfect. You. Honestly. Perfect. This is actually, I'm gonna say this this yeah. this is this is more than I expected. I was yeah. saying Wow. Everything lit. I hope you are you good vibes only. Good vibes only. Uh, yeah, I'll drink your water. Yes, water for here. Coconut water. Coconut. Yes, yes. Keep it. Thanks so much for coming. Yes. <laughs>I'm just glad I'm getting better at speaking. No, you did That's amazing. My goal. Like, honestly, like everything flowed so nicely. Oh my gosh, the rehearsal, great job. And yeah, literally, like, oh, it's getting so much easier. I was shaking yeah. in the beginning, and then I calmed down. You can't I see it, but my leg was like, no, I know oh, I had mean. to like take it off the ledge for a second because it couldn't stop. I'm like, ah. it was like a larger crowd or sometimes like different people. right before you're about to speak, it's like everything leaves your head. Again, everything just came naturally yeah. to you and like flowed. No, everything you said honestly was perfect, and it was everything that like we talk about. It was yeah. like one of our conversations. Yeah. Yeah. Now we're gonna go corporate, and we're gonna take the bag. I think it's fine. Right, it's not. Right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you deserve what it. What time is it now? This is time for you to eat. It's 4 a.m. <laughs> Mm. Which ones are you doing? That's not the list. Yeah. I'm outside in an AMG.
Right outside, TT Two turn, baby, girl, you know me Still with the dogs that I grew beside All the niggas around me, ride or die Gotta watch the time, cause it's flying right by I'm outside in an AMG Right outside, TT Two turn, baby, girl, you know me